welcome to my weekend shave. Um, Sunday, very nice day today outside for a change. And uh, hopefully the rest of the week, because I'm off on holiday. Um, this is a video for, or a dedicated video to a good friend of mine on Facebook, um, Rob Frank. As uh, most of you might have heard that um, he's in hospital in critical condition and uh, as wet shavers we're getting together donating either money or donating um, shave gear uh, to go into a raffle um, to get some money to give to Rob and his family to help him through this hard time. Um, so today I'm going to be using one of his favourite tops, which is Eaton College. I've gone full tilt today for, with this. Um, got the uh, hair and body shampoo. Use that in the shower. You've seen the soap, the uh, body spray or body mist. Um, and I'll be finishing off with the Eaton College cologne. So if you want to uh, donate either money or shave gear, um, Peter Charcullis in America um, is collecting through his PayPal account and Nolan Kimber of the UK Wet Shaving Society is collecting through his PayPal account. Um, doesn't matter how much you give, whether it be a pound, a dollar, whatever you can afford. You know, small amounts add up to a great amount, so um, all donations are appreciated. Um, razor today is another shave on the Progress long handle with the Nipe shave on the Gillette Wilkinson blade. Then I'll have caught up almost with Paul H. Because uh, today's shave he chose to use a Persona Red. So yeah, and uh, the setting will be on, if you can see that, on a four, just see that, yeah, for the uh, first two passes and then down to a two for third pass and touch ups. So I'll leave that in the sink to warm the blade up. Oh, and the post shave is going to be lavender. So there's another product that uh, Rob likes to use is Arco Cool. It's the balm. And this I've got recently from Tesco's here in the UK, which is the L'Oreal for men. Mountain Water. It's an aftershave splash. Sort of a um, uh, aqua marine type of scent. Whipped my lather up into a plastic bowl. I'm using the thought I'd pull out the uh, satin tip today. If you're new to wet shaving and you haven't you don't know who Rob Frank is or um, what he's about. Um, he's on. He's got a YouTube channel, Wattenson One. That's all one word. W O T A N S O N One. Um, he's a YouTuber, vlogger, whatever you want. Does reviews on uh, the shave gear. He's got mail calls. Um, just general what's going on in his life. Um, his wife is kindly uh, leaving updates on a group that's been made specially for him called Friends of Rob Frank. So every couple of days she'll go on there and give us an update on his condition. So hopefully, fingers crossed, he does pull through. Because uh, 
those that are friends with him just miss him really badly. He doesn't do um, shaven uh, videos as such like, like I'm doing now, but if he get his, uh, um, he likes badger brushes and uh, single edges. Um, soap is a big fan of uh, PAA soaps. So as I say, if you've not seen these videos, go over to Watterson1 and uh, check out these videos there. Yep, it's on number four. As you can hear, it's still cutting well. I don't normally do this as a rule, keep using the one blade, but just interesting to see how far a blade will go. And a bit more on this soap. I went on the uh, website of Taylor Vol Bond Street. Um, it says a beautiful masculine fragrance with dominant citrus lemon notes combined with a fruity citrus notes of orange and mandarin. All this is blended with gentle floral notes that rest on a base of warm patchouli. Contains lemon oil and patchouli oil. I bought this um, Eaton College back in December of 2014. We were down in London to watch um, a show at the Lyceum. Um, was it Lion King. So before we went in to watch that, uh, we had a little walk around and I happened to fall upon Taylor Vol Bond Street. Geo Trumpers. You can't look in the window, you've got to go in, you know, see what's available. Not a very big shop, but um, they've got a lot of stuff in there.
think it's out of Bond Street. I've got a video on YouTube. So if you want to check that out, sort of a insight to what they've got inside the shop. We've even got a space out the back where you can get a, a wet shave. I must say this um, Eaton Chalk College is one of my favourites. Um, German Street is another one I like. Right, that's the first pass. Do my normal thing, pause the video, have my second and third pass, touch ups, and then come back. So I'll see you in a minute. Welcome back. It's a uh, later thing that's getting a bit long in the tooth now. Um, had to do a little bit more work than I would normally. Um, but it's the knife shave, so can't complain. That's the um, Merca Progress long handle, loaned to me by Ian Pennicott. Thanks very much, mate, again. Yes, that was a ninth shave, ninth shave on the um, Gillette Wilkinson blade with uh, Ink College. If you don't have this, then I'd suggest you get it because it's really nice. Um, with the soap off with the satin tip you can see how good the soap is it's only used a little bit I've still got a bit in the bowl and there's enough there for probably another two two shaves I know it's getting a bit thin now because I've added some water but um, still peaky and uh, yeah, let's go for the lavenders, which are the layers. And the, the bottom, the Arco Core. Cool. I think it was um, Rob that put me on to this one. So. Another fresh aquatic sort of scent. The uh, L'Oreal uh, refreshing post shave splash. Got this from uh, Tesco's, a uh, supermarket here in the UK. So, um, it's a third off the price, but mm. so on the shelf, I've seen a few other uh, members on the UK Wet Shame Society got this, so I thought I'd get it, have a go. See what it's like. And the uh, clone of the Eaton College. So yeah, um, go over to uh, Friends of Rob Frank, join the group. Um, as I say, 
give a little donation if you can afford it. Um, otherwise, um, I think there's a collection in the UK. Uh, getting a, a package together of shaving gear that's going to be sent out to Rob. Um, so if you can't donate money, um, donate something from uh, your shave den or you know, whatever you feel like. As I, as I said, any small amount counts, you know. I think the, the US um, Peter Charkellis or Shaving with Charky on YouTube he's collected about $3,000 so far so yeah we are getting there but as I said every penny counts so, so hopefully Rob you get to see this when you come out of hospital and uh, see how much um, I appreciate you and um, get well mate so uh, thanks for watching thanks for your subscriptions your likes comments um, your questions any questions just uh, leave them below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can um, hopefully next week I'll be as I said I'm off work so hopefully for those who wish to see a longer video I'll be doing that um, so yeah, thanks for watching, uh, hopefully next week I'll be doing a Tuesday, a Thursday and as it's Father's Day next Sunday I'll be doing a Sunday shave because I've got a special soap and splash to use for then. I can't use it before then because the wives uh, confiscated it. So see you next time, see you in a couple of days, bye.